Welcome to the Omega Studio News slash Talk Show T. I'm your host, Kareem Clemens. Thank you for taking the time to join me here on Speaker Studio Podcast. This is the Omega Studio News. News you can use. Welcome to the Omega Studio News. I'm your host, Kareem Clemens. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for joining me today here, 9-4-2017 at uh, 1.48 a.m. I was supposed to start at 1.30, but I had to get everything together. Happy Labor Day. I forgot to say Omega Studio News slash Talk Show T. Oh, God bless me. Okay, so um, it's a brand new episode. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for taking the time to listen to this podcast. It's been a long time since I've been up here, but I had to show some love up here, here on this Labor Day, 2017, September the 4th. So I'm going to begin this uh, speaker studio podcast by uh, talking about um, first, I want to say that I'm breaking news um, on uh, Hurricane Harvey. Now, I know that a lot of people have um, donated, and I know a lot of people have um, uh, chipped in because uh, this has been a devastating uh, hurricane that has uh, hit landfall uh, since previous hurricanes. And there is one more hurricane that it's on its uh, way. Hopefully it don't hit the United States, but um, that's Hurricane Irma. But um, I would like to say at this time, and you can find more information on kareenclemens.wixsite.com slash Omega Studio News. So Hurricane Harvey was the first major hurricane to make landfall in the U.S. since Wilma in 2005. Four-day period, so many areas received more than 40 inches over eastern Texas, causing catastrophic flooding. After it was over, hundreds of thousands of homes displaced more than 30,000 people and prompt more than 17,000 rescues. Total of 48 confirmed fatalities, damages is estimated in the tens of billions of dollars, winds at 130 miles per hour and formed against formed well it actually started on uh, uh, August the 17th and it ended sometime around the 29th or 30th that was around my birthday so the Omega Studio News slash talk show T stands with all those who have been affected by this and we are praying and have made a donation uh, if you would like to help uh, in the ways you can help, please go to uh, some of the websites that are posted on the kareenclemens.wixsite.com slash Omega Studio News. Uh, they do have uh, a gofundme.com slash Hurricane Harvey. Uh, they also have www.unitedwayhouston.org slash flood slash flood flood donation. Then they also have um, the uh, www.secure.directrelief.org and you can go to um, www.donatenow.networkforfood.org slash feeding Texas and for the animals uh, you can go to www.spca.org slash give. Thank you all, and as Americans, we will get through this together 
and in prayers, we love you. I want to say uh, the ways that you can um, contact the Omega Studio News is on Facebook by going to the Omega Studio News page. It's no longer fan page. It's just Omega Studio News community page. And also, if you would like to follow us on Twitter, you can go to Omega Studio News on Twitter. And if you would like to go to Instagram, is Omega Studio News. Snapchat is not up and running yet, but I do have the YouTube channel, which is Omega Studio News slash Talk Show T. So a couple of things. I believe in, uh, we're in September now. So September, I September, I know that there will be um, new episodes coming out for the um, for here, the Omega Studio News, uh, the Speaker Studios here on podcast, and also the new talk show T uh, episode ten. So I know a lot of people have been asking me when can I do the episode ten, and it will be coming very soon. Uh, I'll be back doing regular broadcasting for that, as well as doing um, videos for the Omega Studio News. I don't have that much time on here, which speaker, that's S-P-R-E-A-K-E-R, Studio, allows you a short time uh, for free, and um, the rest you have to pay. So I try to use the free time and, you know, to... um, basically do the recordings and then uh, go to, um, if you want to do live, then what they do is they can publish you on uh, uh, iHeartRadio and they have like your own segment, but you have to have a lot of people. Um, The Omega Studio News here don't have a lot of people. I'm just now getting back to um, recording. So this is the first episode. Um... In a long time, I know I had other episodes up on there in the past, but unfortunately I had to delete them because I didn't have enough storage space. And without that being said, the videos that was being recorded needed to be um, deleted because of the um, the storage space. <clears throat> so right now um, I'm back. September 4th, Labor Day. It's a Monday. I'm very excited, very excited to be here, very excited to do this segment. I'm sorry it's short. However, this video, along with other videos, will be on the archives on the Omega Studio News on YouTube. Okay? So, I also want to say thank you very much for all the people who sent out birthday shoutouts. My 26th birthday, 26, I wish I was 26, my 36th birthday was on the 29th of August, okay? I had a very fantastic time, Um, went to New Jersey, I'm very happy about that, Um, got a little tipsy, Um, but nevertheless, I'm very excited that I'm able to see the 36. For some strange reason, I have 37 on my tongue, but I'm not 37 yet. Um, but I want to thank everybody through my social media pages, Facebook, Twitter, especially all, you know, shout out to all the social media pages. Uh, there is Twitter. Uh, thank you so much. I don't even know Twitter. And every time when I went to Twitter on my birthday, they shout, shout me out, you know, happy birthday all day. Balloons all day. Facebook, shout out to Facebook. Facebook, show you love by, uh, you know, giving you a 
you know, a picture of birthday cake and, you know, keeping your birthday alive on your social media, Facebook page. Shout out to Google, who actually changed your homepage to Google birthday candles. So, and that stays on 24 hours. You understand? So, shout out to all of them. Shout out to T.S. Madison, who I love dearly. Uh, she did a um, a little gig uh, in Philadelphia on yesterday, uh, actually on Saturday. Shout out to her. Shout out to you can applaud. She did a gig on Saturday the 2nd in Philadelphia. I've seen a video, seen the pictures. It looked like it was awesome. It looked like she had a great time. She always had a great time. It seemed like Philly had showed her love. So I do believe on the 9th and the 10th of this week, which is Saturday and Sunday, she will be at the Jacob Javits Center in New York City. And when I went online to see the tickets, it seemed like they were sold out on that Saturday. So, uh, unfortunately, uh, the tickets are sold out. Those particular tickets are sold out on Saturday, but they have a VIP package, another package, which is, uh, um, I think, in a, about a hundred and something dollars for a um, VIP package. I think everything was sold out. Um, but yeah, shout out to T.S. Madison. Shout out to Carly Harrison, who is, um, uh, down in Atlanta, Georgia, she um, actually the saying "I'm here for the shit." So I seen some of her videos today. Shout out to her. Shout out to her awards that she had won today um, at the uh, at the ball. So shout out to Kelly Harrison. Shout out to Princess Diamond. Where are you, Princess Diamond? I love your pictures on social media. You look fabulous. Uh, shout out to her. Also, want to say shout out to Al and Daquan for an awesome job they're doing for the Omega Studio News slash Talk Show T. Thank you so much. Okay, so unfortunately, I don't have that much time. So, um, you know, I guess. This was a very quick 15 minutes that went by. Was it 15 minutes? Oh my God. Yeah, it was 15 minutes. So yeah, so I guess I'm going to end it here. And then hopefully uh, I'll be back this week uh, to give you guys some update. Or I'll probably be back here later on today. Okay, so thank you so much. And I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Take care.